little kitties. I can't really go here. Hi, kitty. Oh, two kitties. So I can't really go here the way I want to, but let me try to uh, get this content. So, okay. Sky Jackson finally breaks the news that she is actually pregnant, which we all knew because she been acting real weird. Um, you know, normally she would be on Sky's, um, Kai's stream or just out and about, you know, making content with her friends and stuff like that. And she hasn't been out in months, you know, so, and it's not like she has like just disappeared all in all. No, she still is making content, but she only is making content showing her, um, you know, like from her chest above. So, listen. If y'all got kids that are like Sky Jackson, especially young girls, teenagers, and things like that, I think that y'all should not allow your kids to follow her pregnancy journey because, you know, she is now in a new era of her life, soon to be motherhood. And this is a new era, you know. Um, I remember when I was first getting into my mommyhood journey, you know, it was new for me. It was beautiful. It was, you know, one of the greatest times of my life. But if you don't want your child to go down that same road as far as experiencing teen pregnancy, you know, um, children before marriage or, you know, anything of that sort, you need to not let your kids support her at this time. Maybe once she has the baby, I don't know, because even that, even that can be like romanticized, you know, because everybody loves babies. They're, they're you know they're so little they're newborn and they're so innocent <laughs> and we bring them here so i just matter of fact i think y'all should ban your young daughters from just anything to do with sky jacking because not only is she pregnant but come to find out shout out to cleo trapa um he got three kids. He got three fucking kids. So, oh, allegedly, he got three kids, um, you know, before he got with Sky. So, I don't know. Um, that's that story. It's too fucking crowded. I don't know. But if I were you and my child was a fan of Sky and she kept up with her through social media and things like that, her, her, um, her work, you know, her acting gigs and things. Me, personally, I would ban my child from keeping up with her. Not that you're trying to hide, you're trying to hide the world from your kid. No, it's not about that. You know, what it's about is, um, you know, protecting your children's innocence and, you know, continuing to guide your child for as long as they will allow. And I'm going to need the church to say amen. You know, because once children start getting, and people that are way older than Sky, y'all know what the fuck I'm talking about right here. Once you start getting into those fine ages of 18, 19, 20, 21, you think you're grown, you think you know everything, and you have your life planned out. Like I said in a previous content video that I made about Sky Jackson, when, um, when we didn't officially know if she was pregnant, I was telling y'all that her mother, well, I was like, where is her mother? Where is Sky Jackson's mother? But then I broke down to you all that when you come from that lifestyle, you know, um, working at such a young age, having your own money and you're, you're set. You have your own everything. Your parents don't need to do anything for you because they have set you up. And really, you've set yourself and God has set you up in such a beautiful position in your life that you don't you don't really need for shit. You know, and that's truly a blessing. But when people come from those sort of lifestyles where they have everything ever since they were a children and their life is all destined and planned out and, you know, they tend to make, you know, mistakes like this. And I'm not saying her baby is a mistake, you know, because babies are a blessing. But I'm pretty sure if she, once she have the baby and she gets back into her right mind, her new mommy mind, she is going to question herself as far as why did I choose this man? You know, why didn't I choose somebody else? You know, why did I keep the baby, right? Because you want to keep your baby, but I get it. You know, I kept my first baby as well. So, um, <clears throat> you know, or, you know, you didn't do enough research. Did you know that he had three other kids before yours? 
you know, did you know that he was a fucking jailbird? You see what I'm saying? But you actually have the baby and you're in that mindset of mommy mode now. It's something in your brain. It just clicks. You really start to see the truth. So, you know, try not. This is not I'm not trying to eat Scott Jackson up. She's she's younger than me. Um, so I would never do that. You know, I'm trying to guide and also help others in the same breath. But I, I just want to say this. I just want to say to everybody um, that is in tune with the Sky Jackson news. And I know I'm not looking at y'all. I'm looking at my surroundings. But um, what y'all should do, though, because she is with child, y'all, y'all should take it easy on her. You know, she's pregnant. She's hormonal. She has to deal with. I'm pretty sure her mother is trying to take it easy on her as well. Um, you know, the media is going hard on her. She got this fucking ain't shit baby daddy, you know. Um, I'm pretty sure she has beat herself up enough. But because she has decided to continue to walk through that door of motherhood and single motherhood at that. Because they are not married. So she is a single mother technically. Um, whether he decides to stay in a child's life or not. She's still a single mother. They're not married. So, um, yeah, just take it. E I, I just want y'all to take it easy on her. Um, we still love Sky. You know, some of us have been there, right? Pre teen pregnancy. Um, you know, just early 20 pregnancy and then um, having children out of wet lot type shit. So we've all, a lot of people have been there. And, um, but you must believe this. God makes no mistakes. Y'all need to know that. God makes no mistakes. If God sent Sky that fucking baby, then he knows what he's doing in her life. And at the end of the day, it has shit diddly squat to do with none of us. It has shit diddly squat to do with none of us. Yeah, we can say our opinions all day and speak like, oh, what, what I would have did and what I did and, oh, I wouldn't have done. At the end of the day, Sky is just trying to enjoy her pregnancy and she's really saying fuck the internet and fuck people talking shit about her because she's only human, right? Again, God makes no mistakes. If God sends you that baby and you feel it in your heart and your spirit to keep it, then fuck what anybody else says fuck what everybody else says be, you know be the best parent that you can be you know love the fuck out of your kid you know everybody else has something to say fuck them so that's my little one two about sky i wanted to give you some content real quick <laughs> i don't even know how this looks because i got on my shades and it's it's nighttime y'all but um i love y'all this this video is only almost eight minutes normally we go to 10 um it's all right but yeah i love y'all and i'll see y'all in the next one bye